What up guys, Mike Black, Mike the Mac, Mr. Mills, definitely not inside of some building somewhere. So listen, I drug my whole house, this big giant tailgater machine, with my motorcycle in the back that you can drive up the rear of the vehicle, and tow with my diesel truck. So I have this tailgater by T-Stone XT that I'm going to be selling for 20 grand once I fix the floor and put a new roof in it. This thing was like over 100000 And, uh... So I'm doing some work to that, but on the way here, my little kitty, come here, kitty boy. Kitty, 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 come here. Come here, baby. Monkey boy. Well, I don't know where baby monkey is, but he's causing trouble. He's out here with me. He chewed on, he chewed on my machine inside of here. I, I had it uh, tied down in the shop, because this is a movable shop with, filled with tools and toolboxes and matco and snap-on and all the good stuff and sawzalls and every other decent thing and tvs and computers and stoves and ovens where i just cook some chicken rice um anyway the kitty chewed on the tie downs and knocked my bike down when he knocked it down now that's the same one that i got hit and run with in florida and then shot by the cops and the bad guy shot me to pieces blew holes right in me blew a hole right in my head I couldn't think straight for two, three weeks, maybe even a month. So when the boy knocked the bike down, it flattened my coolant reservoir and uh, blew this thing into thousands of pieces. I don't know why they made it out of plastic, because they're stupid, apparently. Hey, there goes Kitty Boy zooming through. Hi, Kitty Man. So this little device goes right here. See? See? goes right there and it holds some coolant just in case you're uh hi kitty mister hi monkey baby baby monkey hi no oh, he's running off so yeah they made this piece of junk out of plastic which i have now rebuilt i took all the busted pieces they were in about a million pieces and i kind of glued them together weekly with some paper and some super glue and then i grabbed some fiberglass and a bunch of fiberglass resin tape paper whatever you want to call that crap and this stuff is poison it's poison for sure but it builds a super strong waterproof environment which when i just built this thing and then sanded it down has a couple holes in it so i'm going to repair it right now and when i finish this i'll give you guys a video of how to repair any device of yours with some good fiberglass you want to chop up pieces of this white stuff into little films and throw them inside your your um, mixture right here. And you use about, I don't know, I use about two tablespoons of this stuff. It's the resin. And then you only drop about five drops of this in. And like I said, it makes a super... Hi, kitty mister. Hi, super baby. Hi, superman. Hi, mister. Um, yeah, after I got shot to pieces by the bad guys and the cops, I didn't do nothing wrong. I was just stopped at a red light. But after that happened, one of my friends the second day when I was still dying or dead, actually I was dead and I was trying to become alive again, she brought me this little tiny kitty that was 10 days old. And the little 10-day-old kitty was dying. They took him from his mom, I don't know why, and gave him to me. So he hid under the toolbox for three weeks. And he'd only come out a little bit to eat some water and to eat some milk and to eat some food and... Now I've raised him into a little man. He's about three months old. So yeah, I got invited for Harley Davidson 120th. So I came up from Florida, back to my home in Wisconsin, where my friend Jeff lives. He's one of my best friends I've ever had in my life. And he's a guy who has about 55 dually trucks and about 55 junk cars. And he won't junk any of them, which is none of my business. But his wife has been acting a fool and going crazy because she's a nut job. And uh, she's been threatening to burn down his house and punching him in his face and talking all kinds of mess. So I'm trying to get the flock out of here. But when I did this device, it still has two leaks in the end. So I'm just going to film it over again and I'll take another video of it when I'm done. This is already five minutes. It's super long lasting and I know you guys don't like my long talks. 
So hopefully, please subscribe to my channel if you want to learn anything about bike building or anything else. Or if you're a Christian or if you love Jesus and God, let me know. Everybody who subscribes is part of my family. I have a new kid that works at the uh, Piggly Wiggly. I think his name's Alex. I could be wrong, but he's a good kid and he just started watching our movies. So you guys pass some uh, likes to him and, and subscribe to any of his internet stuff. He's a good kid and he greets me every day that I go shopping with good words and uh, good good praises. So anyways, guys, like I said, it's already over five minutes. I love you guys, and I thank you guys, and I need more. I need so many subscribers. I think you have to have a 1,000 before they'll even pay you. I only have 310. I used to have a quarter million before the uh, election in 2016, and then they killed my money, killed my everything. You know, I was the 77th YouTuber in the world, meaning that I was on way, way, way back in the day. I've got movies that are so old you wouldn't believe it. Anyway, Mike Black, Mike the Mac, Mr. Scrawny Mills now, who lost over 100 pounds. Yep, I lost over 100 pounds, man. I only weigh about a buck 75. Scrawny is a freaking newborn baby. Anyway, pray for me. I'll pray for you. I love you guys. God bless you all. In Jesus' name, I pray for everyone. Amen.